How's it going, my friends? This is Anakis, and today we're doing a review for Masters of the Universe Origins Buzzsaw. You can see you have the figure in the front, and the nice retro carded artwork. More artwork on the back. Cross sell and the gimmick. Uh, Buzzsaw was one of my favorite figures when I was growing up. I don't ever remember seeing him in the cartoon, but now I was playing with the toys. He was always one of the ones that was front and center. Uh, I think I still have my buzz off when I was a kid. The peg on the back's broken. I'm missing all, all the accessories, but I think I still have them. If I do, I'll put comparison photos of both versions. In the Instagram channel, Atticus Toy Reviews. So go ahead and check that out, among lots of other photos. But uh, let's go ahead and get him out of the box and check him out. And welcome to Atticus Toy Reviews. And here we have Bazov out of the package, and he looks really nice in the yellow and browns. Nice detail. Very insect looking like. He's armed with his uh, axe, which I was, looks like it's molded off the original. I found it hard for him to hold it. The original, if I can remember, and it's still hard for him to hold this one. He also comes with instructions. And the challenge of Jitsu, which I just realized I don't have Jitsu, and there's like 10 of them as a local target. I'm gonna have to pick him up today. Anyway, now we're saying his axe. His helmet and the original just kind of sat on the top of his head, but this one he's got the antennas. And look at that friendly face. Hi friends, I'm just gonna sting you and uh, inject a bunch of venom in you. Don't worry, I won't survive this a year ending. Oh, but really. Not bad if he still looks very jovial and happy. Because he is a hero. There's his helmet. And his wings. And you can see they fold down like that. Articulation is pretty on par for the origin figures. Yeah, you can rotate 360, you can look down, you can look up. You can do a T-pose. Armors can rotate 360. There's a bend and a swivel at the elbow. Santa can go 360 and go up and down. There's waist articulation. Legs can go up, back, to the side. Doesn't super kick very well. Bend and swivel at the knee, and full range of articulation in the feet. I was very happy when they announced him, because I think I said before, he was one of my favorites as a kid. I'm glad to have a new retro looking one in my collection. I only if I can find Webster and Stinkor. I'd be, I'd be very happy. But this figure, I'm giving him a 10. He's awesome. I like this figure a lot. Really hits the nostalgia with me. Uh, if you like this video, give me a thumbs up down below. Like, share, subscribe, whack that bell for notifications. And remember to keep hitting those toy aisles. I'll see you guys next time. Later.